heavyweight champion of the world, Joe Frazier. Shake hands now, man. Return to your corner. Hold it. Muhammad Ali no versus Joe Frazier. And Ali has said this man must fall in six. He's 15 stone five. He outreaches Frazier. You shall see Frazier come forward like this, shuffling in, looking for the chance. He picks his man off from the distance. And Clay looks out and says, he didn't hurt me. Nine and a half pounds heavier. He's telling at close quarters, a good right hand from Frazier's hooks falling short. Clay Clay's hurt and he dances away from the rope. What a good right arm from Clay. What a fight. This is Fraser keeps coming forward and this is what he's always going to do. He has to take him as he Good left hooks from Fraser. A lot of them on the arms. And Clay really is out tonight to show us what he can do. Here we go again with some second round action. Into Fraser now. That's a good left hook. These two are really testing each other. This is the best heavyweight. Fraser flogs his way through the defenses. That's a good left hook, and there's a speck of blood on Clay's nose. Clay's bleeding from the nose at the end of round three and he's having to go through it on the rope. And that was Joe Frazier's round. Clay could do about it. He couldn't stop him coming at him. That's the big one. Four. Heavyweight championship resumes action. To come out of this on his feet either. Face of Frazier. The greater number of punches being landed by Clay in this round. As he moves back, there's the big one. And he got hurt. But he's still got his wits up. And this fight explodes from second to second. And Frazier bulldozed his way through again. Well, we got two rounds. If this prediction of Muhammad Ali is Round to come true, he's at the five. six. Talking has stopped. Clay's got his work cut out now with this fight, and he knows it. Smiles back at Clay as Clay catches him to the head. I don't know what he said, but obviously he was showing contempt. For he's got a few bumps around his eyes now, Frazier. Frazier grins, laughs. The fighter's worth that, but these two are giving some value here. Fifth round. The Frazier's going to fall in six. Cassius Clay has done a lot of work, and he scored with a lot of punches, and Frazier takes a swipe at him. Um, Madison Square Garden in New York City, and this is the round that Muhammad Ali predicted just before the fight. And endurance. This is what he tried to do with Liston. And funnily enough, round about this stage. And he plays about with him. And there's the bell corner and he shakes his head. And so the infallibility of Muhammad Ali has come unstuck. Well, Frazier predicted he'd win inside 10. Oh, what a big pumping left hook. This is really astounding, the way he treats this man, Frazier. And I think he's got a lot of good punches home. Clay's round, and I make Clay in front. For Muhammad Ali, he's got the crowd going with him. 
and he motions to Fraser and says, listen, they're rooting for me. And he looks as though he can handle Fraser when he really sets himself to it. There's a shot he took him for a sucker there. Well, they've had one so far. And Candy says, come on, come on, fight. And Clay motions to Fraser to come in and do it. He's trying, being seen on closed circuit television in more than 350 cinemas, theatres throughout North America, and in 33 in Great Britain. Nothing in those punches. That's a good left hook, and he asked for that one and he got it. There's a sort of strange death wish about Clay as though. left hooks in play, one of the rare left hooks of the years, the guy's giving Fraser a working over and Fraser goes back for the first time. Round nine and Clay forced Frazier to retreat. Frazier forced back and hurt. Because he backed up under severe pressure as Clay cut out the fooling and went to work and this is how he did it. Tremendous onslaught a good left hook in reply by Frazier, Clay, because if he takes another hammering like the one he took in the ninth, that he's weakening the former champion. And now Frazier's complaining about the referee and asking to tell the referee to lay off him because he feels he's getting a raw deal in the clinches. He's being told to lay off Clay and he doesn't want it. Frazier wants to work in close, he doesn't want to be at a distance. Started better by Fraser. It's a reversal of what happened in the earlier rounds. Look at this style, reminiscent of Rocky Marciano. Fraser's coming in, bunched over, crouching over, hooking all the time. And they've kept up a tremendous pace. That's a slip. He got caught, but it was a slip. Doing nothing. Incredible man he is. Fraser doesn't quite know what to do about him. So he plays along with it and then tries the big one. He tries to sneak one out of it. And Clay beckons him back. And Fraser really goes after him and he's got him with a left hook. He's done it once too often. Clay's in trouble. Round 11. He's hurt. He nearly went down. Here's the first great climax of this fight. The left hooks are thundering in. And Clay's in trouble and he makes a face. It's a big round for Frazier. And he's hurt again and he almost goes over. Clay's in real trouble. Now he really needs, needs to move. Now is he foxing or is he really hurt? He's hurt. Tremendous round for Frazier. The bell's coming up. Oh, and Clay's play acting again. He pretends he's hurt. This was Muhammad Ali at his worst, fooling about, and Clay this time is not standing. And now this could be the one for Frazier, because he's got his man in trouble. And the former champion has really got to pull something out now. He's in trouble again, and Frazier gets after him. The legs have gone, he's not moving. He hasn't been on the floor since 1963. And it was Henry Cooper who put him there then. Now he gets to work again. Good left hook in Madison Square Garden because now we've seen Clay come through a bad patch. Catch him crazy with good punches again as the champion comes in. Clay. Clay started talking to him again. The eyes of Frazier look very puffed indeed now. Who's going to come out the strong?
longer of this one. The bell coming up. Really slogging those body punches home to Clay, and Clay taking them all and not going down. Tremendous lumps now. Frazier talking to Clay. Two good punches from Clay. And I saw the inside of Frazier's mouth then as it... And his looks really are changing now, the shape of his face is... Good strong finish there by Muhammad Ali. The final three minutes of one of the most amazing world heavyweight championships of all time. This title from the present champion, Joe Frazier. Oh, there it is! The left hook! Frazier's at last caught up with him. Tremendous left hook. Compulsory eight count. So Clay down the first knockdown of the fight. Tremendous left hook. If he's down three times, then the fight is automatically stopped. And Clay is fighting for survival. There's the left hook again. He looks a beaten man. The whole of the side of Clay's face, the right-hand side, is scarlet and swollen. With this extraordinary fight, saved a major sensation for the 15th round. And Fraser has the look of the conqueror about him now as he finishes this fight. Here it comes. It's over and it's gone the distance. And Fraser gives him a contemptuous little pat on the head. And still, heavyweight champion of the world.